What is going on everybody, PHX here. Thank you for stopping by. And in today's video, we are starting our series with Splinter Cell Chaos Theory. Yes, that is right. We are going back into Chaos Theory again. Uh, the one that just revolutionized everything about Splinter Cell added so many quality of life improvements, so many different um, takes on the series. And just uh, this is like the epitome of what Splinter Cell is. Uh, just everything that they did with it was absolutely phenomenal. The noise meter, the way Sam Fisher moved throughout the game, the way the shadows worked, it was just, it was, it was an awesome, awesome take on the game, on the series. And I certainly hope that they bring it into the actual new one that they do, you know, keeping in with the stealth, with, with the shadow and the light overall. I mean, it, Chaos Theory is just like one of the is the best probably in the series. Um, if you like that personally for me, Double Agent is my favorite personal favorite one. Um, but at the same time, there you just cannot beat Chaos Theory whatsoever. But other than that, I mean, I just wanted to give the brief introduction of what we're doing. We're still going through the whole series again. We're still going to be trying to maintain uploads with uh, Chaos Theory um uh, as frequently as possible then we'll get into double agent conviction blacklist like this is ongoing this is going to take a, a few months which is awesome because there's you can't i can't get enough splinter cell and i really hope you guys can either but other than that guys that is it that is all i have for you if you enjoy the series please definitely consider subscribing to the channel for more splinter cell content please definitely leave a like and also leave your comments down below let me know what your thoughts are on chaos theory and if it's your favorite one as well um other than that guys that's all i have i will catch you around in the next video take care to the bad guys you're the american oppressor you're the bad guy are you gonna say monkey what no then this conversation is over get out I think you're right about the equipment, Sam. Yeah? They got themselves a little stockpile of high-tech kit here. The SSCC code is lot one of five. See if you can find the other four. I'll do my best. Jesus, 
see him. I bet he's faking it. Faking it? His tongue is a lump of coal. His brain is enough. Saul, give him more. It's already at the maximum. What? Should I bring down another battery? <laughs> what do you say, amigo? You want another battery? <laughs> Wait a minute. His, uh... His ears. Look. Smoke. I think I'm going to be ill. I think he's dead. <laughs> Only one way to be sure. Uh, I'm going for a walk. <laughs> I already don't like you. Don't make it worse for yourself. Who... Who are you? Shut up. Why did you torture Morgan Holt? Lacerda told us to. Why? What does he want to know? Math problems. Programmer stuff. I don't get it. You're just the stupid one who likes to hurt people, huh? Exactly. Can you think of a reason why the world wouldn't be a better place without you? Ah, uh, please! I... I didn't think so. Yeah, stinks. It doesn't sound too good down there, Fisher. The sound isn't the problem. You should smell it. You're sure he's dead? Deader than Elvis. All right. Leave the body. We still need to recover any traces of the interrogation. Grim will call you back. Fisher, I said leave the body. We don't have the means to extract him. Just because he's dead doesn't mean I need to leave him here hanging like a piece of meat. Don't get too connected, Fisher. I need you to stay rational. You can spare 30 seconds for some simple dignity. Sam, it's Grim. We need to make sure that whatever Morgan Holt might have told them about Mass's algorithms never leaves this site. Okay. I detected a wireless link coming from the technician who left the room before you entered. So I'll need to recover any data he might have uploaded to their servers. Exactly. From the looks of it, these gorillas have a pretty temporary setup. Seems unlikely they have any kind of alarm system on location. Good. Hi there. You look important. I am loyal. You will get no information from me. Really? Hmm, it looks like you forgot to shave this morning. Let me help you out a bit. Huh? You can't! Hey, what are you doing? Okay, okay. What do you want to know? I'm looking for Lacerda. He's been behaving very badly lately. Well, you're wasting your time, American. He left on a boat an hour ago. He could be anywhere by now. I guess I'll just have to follow him then. Don't worry. He won't slip away. I think that confirms it, Fisher. Yeah, seems like Lacerda's long gone. We'll see if we can track him through Echelon. Don't worry about him for now. We'll keep you posted. I saw something on the
attack was launched hours ago with the ISS, following what is now being reported as a possible strike by a micrometeor. NASA officials are currently verifying that orbital debris from previous space missions was not responsible for the accident. No contact has yet been made with either the astronauts aboard the ISS or with the shuttle which is docked to the station. How do I stay for you? I don't. But it sure helps to look at it. Your skin deserves the best in so many ways. Try our new That's four of the five crates, Sam. Keep your eyes peeled for the last one. Why did you torture Morgan Holt? The cell that he wants algorithms, some kind of computer algorithm. What does a second-rate communist revolutionary want with a computer algorithm? I don't know. I don't even think La Cerda knows. I think someone might have hired us. What makes you think that? I don't know. La Cerda. He's been making lots of deals. Something's going on. I don't know what. But you don't know who he's been talking to. No! And you're not much good to me anymore. <laughs> That server is the one that the tech transferred the interrogation record to. You'll need to access it. Good work, Sam. That wiped whatever information Morganhold might have given them. Don't they wonder what happened to it? It was easy enough to make your little intrusion look like a memory allocation error. Don't worry, we give you the best tools. You look troubled. Thunderstorms make me Why? I was a boy in Granada when the Americans invaded in 1850. My father was in the army. When he realized we could not win, he led us into the mountains with some of his men, and all of our families. And the Americans caught up with us one night in the middle of a thunderstorm. A thunderstorm like this one. What happened? They struck in the dark. We never heard them, never saw them. They timed their fire with the thunder. The <laughs> How come no one ever does things to make my job safer? If you want me to hire some more animals to interpret information, I can do that. On second thought, the danger's not so bad. Hi, you the old game. How am I supposed to get this place up and running with all this old crap? Who would put that game here anyway?
Evening Star to Maria Narcisa, come in. Evening Star to Maria Narcisa, come in. Cargo received, Maria Narcisa, it all checks out. Affirmative, Maria. Maria Narcissa. You're not trying to set me up on another blind date, I hope. The Maria Narcissa is a boat. So was the last girl you sent me. Fisher. Sorry. The Maria Narcissa is a cargo ship owned and operated by Celestinia Inc., Portuguese shipping company. Registered in the Philippines, cross Pacific freight contracts. Lots of details missing. Sounds suspicious. Sounds like I'm setting you up for another date after all. Can't wait to meet her. Be sure your primary objectives are complete. Extract you whenever you're ready. You'll need to signal for a helicopter pickup from the top of the lighthouse. Make sure the light is out first. Will do.